Good morning and happy Vlogmas day one. Okay, so this video is going to maybe get a little bit confusing, but we are starting Vlogmas Day 1 with a very exciting surprise, starting 2022 Vlogmas off with a bang. So this one's going to be a long one. Why don't we just jump right into it and the video will speak for itself. What did we just do? Bought a house. We're homeowners, dang it! Woo! So I am standing in our new home. We just closed on the house. I'm so excited. I already got clips of all the before because we're about to demo to and redo to this whole freaking house. Get off the floor. we gotta work. I will get some clips as we go. I'm sure there will be many house videos coming soon, but we're gonna get to work. I'm so excited and we're gonna do a lot of changes to this house in the next couple weeks before we move in. So I'm so excited. Here's a little quick overview, but let's get to work. Sean's like, okay, pack your work boots, like your steel toe boots. I'm like, who do you think I am? I do not own work boots. Okay, we're gonna have to get you a pair. I'm like, sir. I'm here for the content. No, I'm just kidding. I'm gonna help for sure. Um, today's project is unloading the vehicles of tools that Sean packed in both of our, his truck and my car and starting the demolition process. So ripping up the floors, the baseboards. Um, he's gonna tear this thing down in the kitchen, just like wild. But I'm so excited. And of course I'll bring you guys along through every step, but let's get to work. Okay, so here's the progress so far. Sean's ripped up. It's hard to see with the lighting, but a lot of the tiles ripped up. I've done most of the baseboards um, around the house, and then I ripped up all of the carpet in the master bedroom and the master closet. So all the carpet's ripped up. I just have to do these like little nail strips on the edge, but all the old carpet is done. So I have to finish the baseboards. Eventually this floor is gonna come up. This floor is gonna come up. But we made pretty good progress in like what, an hour and a half, not even? Yeah. Like an hour. But we are sweating so bad. We don't, we're out of water, so. We're gonna have to go pick up some water. Let's see if our neighbors are still outside to go say hello. But basically, no they're not. Basically our lease isn't up till the end of the month. So we have a couple weeks to get all these projects done. And then we'll move our stuff in. So Sean's gonna be here like every day when he's not at work. Obviously I have work during the week. So I won't be able to be here during the day, but I mean for the first day, We've made some pretty good progress. I might head home to the apartment to check on the pets and whatnot here soon, but pretty good progress. It's just a lot of tile to go. Hey vlog. Okay, so I am driving home after the first day of home demo slash renovations. I'm exhausted. Sean's gonna stay and work for a couple more hours, but I wanted to go home, check on the pets. I need to do a big shower. My hands have blisters. <laughs> it's hard work. I, uh, I underestimated how much hard work it's gonna be, but we're so excited. And I'm excited to vlog and take you guys along the process. Um, so 
today's progress was the start of the tile. We were on a roll. We were like, dang, we are moving right along. Like everything's going faster than we thought. And then we kind of hit a wall, both of us. Um, the tile towards the middle was actually glued down pretty good. Um, whereas at first it was like not, it was coming up already. So it was a little bit easier. And then the baseboards, I was moving along. And then I realized that in the areas, um, I did them all where there was carpet, did them where there was wood floors, it was fine, but the areas where there's tile, the baseboard is like sandwiched between the tiles, so it's just like kind of hard to get it up. So we're gonna do the tile first and then the baseboards on that part. My dad's coming into town this weekend to help Sean with more home stuff. Obviously, I'm back to work um, during the week, so I'm not gonna be much help but I'm just, I'm excited. Of course, like, as much as it sucks that we have to do, like, or I guess we don't have to, but we wanna do all these renovations before we move in. Like, I'm so excited that I just wanna move everything in and like live there now, but it makes way more sense to do it all before we move our stuff. We have our apartment for a couple more weeks, so it all worked out for the best. It almost like still hasn't really hit me yet that like that's our new home and like we actually own it and all is said and done and we actually have a house. Like we're first time home buyers, it's also exciting. But it probably won't, honestly, it probably won't hit me yet until like obviously, duh, we move our stuff in and like start staying there. But I'm so excited, it's in such a good location, central to both of our jobs. It's like near a bunch of dining and food and shopping and I'm just like over the moon excited, so. I'm gonna head home. Okay, so day two of demo renovations. I just got here from work. And I'm gonna show you guys the progress that was made. So the closet's the same as yesterday. Here, I'll just flip you around. Here's the master bedroom. All the carpet's up and gone, and they started ripping up the um, tack strips. Sean had a friend come help him today. They started to do the wood floor, but the glue that it's stuck down with is like apparently insane. So they didn't make too much progress on that, but this is crazy. It just like is so sad to buy a house and have it look like this already. <laughs> Text made like you just now opened it. Yeah, I believe that. Oh, and I know you think you're still on the low, but I heard how you feel from everybody you know. Day three at the house. <laughs> I'm wearing this because Sean just put um, four adhesive removers. So let's go see what he's up to. wasn't much of an update today. Sean's just been going to town on the floors. He worked um, his firefighter overtime job today during the day and now he's working on that. But I'm gonna head home. I swept a little bit, did more baseboards. It's about 7.15 right now. So I'm exhausted. I need to go home, shower, eat dinner, fold my laundry, do some computer work. I'm like, there's just not enough time in the day. But day three is done. I'm gonna edit our calendar that we made. We made like a calendar of like what work we're gonna do on the house each day and I just need to tweak a couple things but not like super behind just you know stuff's gonna come up when you're renovating a house but it just like it's like bittersweet because I'm so excited that we finally bought the house but it's like now I just want to live here and I know it's good like I'm gonna be really happy when this is all said and done that we did it all before we moved in we don't have to like live during renovations I mean there will be some things like the master bathroom we're not touching right now and you guys saw it has like a big pink outdated tub and whatnot, but one, money-wise and time-wise, we just didn't have the time and we didn't feel like dropping that much money on it when we just dropped so much on the house to begin with. So we'll do that over time, but yeah, just a lot of work. So I'm tired and delirious, so I'm gonna head home. All right, day four of renovations, I think. I haven't been really keeping track. But I'm going to show you guys the progress. So not a ton of progress on this room since I already showed you guys. I ripped out all the baseboards. Um, still
still a crazy mess, but my dad's coming up like really late tonight, early tomorrow morning, and I'm sure a ton will be getting done in here once we have another set of hands. I swept this room up, took the baseboards off, so this is just like a pile of stone remnants that has to be swept up. And then Sean, so this I started to sweep, but there's just like so much stuff, I like couldn't even handle it. But that started, and then Sean did a lot in this room yesterday, so he did this panel, and I just came in and swept everything that was like wood everywhere into this, and then when this got full, I put it in a pile right there, just away so that tomorrow when him and my dad come in the morning, they can immediately start doing this floor a little bit more, and I can dump this and then go get that. So that's the progress there. I really don't wanna step on this floor, but there's honestly no progress in the master bedroom as of right now. I'll show you guys anyways, but this adhesive stuff and wood, it keeps getting stuck to my Crocs and I didn't change my shoes. So again, just everything ripped up. Baseboards are done in here. We haven't decided if we're gonna do the floors in both bathrooms or just wait. I don't know. This bathroom is extremely outdated, but I don't think we're going to touch it as of right now, just because that's like a whole nother project. We might paint, because why not? That would be easy to do, depending. Um, but eventually Sean wants to rip this whole closet out, like make the shower bigger, and put like a freestanding tub and like knock this wall down, but I don't know. Things we have to think about, but that is that for the day four update. I'm gonna head home and do social media work. Sean is at the fire station for his 24 hour shift, so no more housework is getting done today, but that is how it's looking. Nothing done outside of the pool either, but it's progress, it's getting there. Um, this weekend will be a big deciding factor of like what we end up doing with the kitchen and like where things go once my dad's here and him and Sean sort of like formulate a better game plan, but I'm gonna head back to the apartment get some work done, and that's it for the house update for today. Good morning, it is day five of home renovation. My dad flew in late last night, and they just went to go get started, and it was my turn to go to Lowe's. So, um, first we went to Walmart, because my dad and I both needed like work shoes. What is happening? Uh, my dad and I both needed like work shoes, and I thought these were actually so cute, and they were like 18 bucks. So hopefully they don't get destroyed and I can actually wear them again. And then we just got some like work socks and random stuff. This is Sean's shirt because I already got rid of all my t-shirts that I would want to ruin, so. And then at Lowe's I had to get AC filters, drywall compound for mudding the walls. Let me just tell you, Lowe's is a freaking maze and the aisles were like all over the place and people directed me to the wrong place, but a drywall knife, a fridge connector, I don't know. Guys, half the stuff I don't even know what it is. I just get what they tell me. Um, seal tape or something. My dad and Sean have like built houses before. I haven't done anything, so. And then sanding blocks, I know what these do, but it was a whole ordeal. Now we are headed to the house. Let's see how far away it is. From here, I think my phone is somewhere in this bag also. Well, that's not good. Okay, please hold. Um, so yeah, so today's a huge work day. There it is. I don't know exactly what's gonna be done, but I'll update you guys as soon as we get there. I think my dad and Sean are like formulating a plan and starting, but I wanted to take a picture of my receipts for the Fetch app because I literally just paid for most of this order with a gift card from there. This is not sponsored, but if you get receipts, like anytime you shop, all you do is take a picture of them, you get points, and you literally redeem them for gift cards. So like I just got a $50 gift card to Lowe's, so I only had to pay 20 bucks for the rest of this order. And it was all just because I take pictures of my receipts. Like there's no catch. I'll leave my code down below in the description for you guys because it is seriously, my mom made me get it and I was like reluctant at first because I was like, I don't understand why do I need that? But it literally has paid for so much. I've gotten like a $100 Amazon gift card from it. It's incredible. So I'm gonna take a picture of my receipts and then we'll head to the house. I'm already sweating. It's 10.50 a.m. My dad flew in at like 12.30 a.m. last night. This old lady's gonna be like, why does this woman have a camera filming herself in her car? 
Um, so I'm very tired, but that's okay. We have a lot of work to get done. Um, Lola jumped off the couch weird and like hurt her like ligament on her leg and I feel so bad, but it's actually probably a good thing that we're not home because she'll just sleep all day. I just hope she's not like running around jumping up and down the couch. Like that's what makes me nervous about not being there to watch her, but it's all right, I suppose. Ooh, the Mountain Dew that my dad got, got me extra bonus points. So yeah, you literally just get points and they add up and you can redeem them for gift cards. But talking a mile a minute, I'm still finishing my coffee from this morning. Okay, cool, we're only six minutes from the house. Cause I have FOMO, I feel like they're gonna do stuff and I'm not gonna be able to vlog it for you guys cause I have my camera here. So, let's go do that. All right, they started ripping this down. And then just, you cut this, make it flush, and then it stitches down on it. Say hi, Dad. Hi, everybody. <laughs> you tell me that you want it, baby, it's a good deal. Oh, mama, I want it, I want it. Oh. Pants by Walmart, shoes by Walmart. Drywall by the family that lived here before. I'm on outlet duty. This is the only job they trust me with. <laughs> Update. <laughs> this is all done. We're doing some cleanup now, but it's time to say goodbye to the cork wall that the previous owners had. Just want to see you with a spot round. Hey, uh, you ain't got to tag me. I can meet the arm in the background. Hey, uh -huh. And I know when you're working as a hostess, they be trying to let you out late. But how late? Because I'll be at the next place calling a day. Okay. And I know you think you're still on the low. But I heard how you feel from everybody you know. So the whole kitchen thingy is gone. I started sanding down these floors to get the cement off. This floor is all done and cleaned up, sort of. This one's done. Just needs to be like sanded down, basically. Um, the wood floor is fully up. Same with that one. This is all done. We looked at the floors, so this is what the floors are going to be throughout the house. Um, so I think we'll do this tomorrow, honestly. And we just have to figure out how to get this glue off. We were just looking at the pool. So that's that. Dad and Sean are working on electrical stuff in the kitchen. This is all still cleared out. We just put adhesive remover down to try and scrape up all this glue and wood and nastiness. And I am on front door duty with our new code lock and all of that. The front door stuff was just like kind of nasty. So I'm gonna figure out how to do this. Okay, so we needed batteries for the new front door thing and we didn't have batteries. I went to two places, they were out of batteries. So I gave up. And now we're gonna go watch the Bills game. Look who came to help. Hey. Gabby's here. We'll see if she helps. Um, Looks like it's slide. They're doing the lights. Basically, the Bills lost. So we should have just worked on the house, but it's fine. Uh, Gabby's actually going to do the door handle because she's a lot smarter than I am. I'm handyman. We have to get the batteries out of the garage. Yeah, but I don't know what I'm doing. She's actually, gonna do that. So. I'll teach her how to do that. Sorry, it's so dark in here. I don't know where the lights are still. Is there a light here? It's also, oh, well, I guess it's all covered. Nope. So. Oh, okay. there's nothing there. So, yeah, she's gonna do the handle and I'm gonna scrape all the adhesive and wood pieces off the floor because we left that stuff to soak for a while. We went to three Home Depots and three Lowe's in the past 24 hours and we can't find any of the stuff we need. Because the hurricane, everybody's buying the same kind of stuff. So, yeah. How do I get into Oh, this hair. Oh, yeah. It's Who needs men, right, Gabby? 
Nine. Engineer, baby. She actually used her degree, everyone. Yay! What do you want to do here? Let's talk. Okay, let's talk. The men are screaming. Let's. Oh, does he mean him? No. Yeah. Not me. <laughs> they don't care about our opinion. They're trying to figure out the light still. So we did the Not front door, right, but we got our job done before they got theirs done. So, so ours is really the bigger front home. doorknob. <laughs> And there's just the whole kitchen light system. There's a lot of steps to that, okay? It was the bottom, it was the deadbolt, it was all of it. And we I need to have a meeting. Do you think they noticed if we just left? I don't think so. I, re I think I think we're good to go. I really don't think there's anything else we can help with. They said there is. The walls. We can wash the walls, but like they're gonna get more dirty. That. I, that's like last step. Like everything's done, then you wash. Well, before the walls. we paint, we have to yeah. paint them. But but they're still working in here, so that's. Yeah, I don't really want to. Uh, the other thing we scraped up the wood. Grinding sucks. I did it yesterday. I think I got work to go to dinner. So. Oh, I do too, actually. Yeah, but I, I work at 6.30 until 6. <laughs> oh, no, I have working at night. I meant. I did sit on sticky stuff, though. And you know I got it off. But, like, it's also on my butt cheek. Like, my actual cheek is sticky. Well, that I can't help you with. <laughs> You're gonna have to shower for that. I just showered. Oh. Okay. Um, TTYL, guys. Hopefully the next I'm time we talk to you. Well, I, no, is this just a renovation? What is it? I do this every day, so no. Tomorrow will be the next okay. time I talk to you, and well, I'll update hopefully you. Hopefully before the next time. I, well, I won't be here tomorrow. Then. She we'll won't be here for that clip, because it'll be in the evening. Hopefully we get to leave soon, and we get food. I want food. Hey, vlogs. I'm gonna update you guys really quick. Sean and my dad have been working all day. Of course, I just turned the light off here. Actually, you know what? I'll just put pictures. I will put pictures right here of day six. They finished the bedroom floor and started the living room floor. But that's basically all they did today with some lighting stuff right here. And then they did the flooring. So pictures are right here. I was at work all day, so I didn't get much. But I'll be back tomorrow with an update. How are you feeling? Sean's laying on the floor. I'll give you guys an update. I just got out of work. So let me go turn the music off. This is all smooth and ready for flooring. So is this. This is what he was just grinding down. Getting there. This is all done, it looks like. And then, wow, there's dust everywhere. But. This is the flooring from last night, and then the bedroom flooring is all done. So, I think he wants me to sweep, so I'm gonna go see if that's still the plan. Um, I don't know if this needs to be scraped up or cleaned or what's going on with this, but I will go see what he needs me to do. I ordered him a pizza for lunch, and I don't think he ate it all, and I might go eat some right now. He's literally covered in head-to-toe dust. Turn to the side so they can see the back of your ear. It is like just dust everywhere. You should hose yourself off. I'm gonna go home and we're gonna collapse and go to sleep because this is what we do every night. We literally get home and we fall asleep immediately. Can you talk or are you mute? I'm just tired. What do you want me to say? How has the process Exhausted. been for you? Exhausting. Okay. It's been We've been living off pizza days of and just doing manual labor. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm and sick of? Monsters and beer. Driving. That's what I'm sick of. Driving back and forth 50 billion times. I have to fill up before I even can leave. <sighs> Say goodnight vlog. Oh my god, right. your face. It looks like when you put that sunscreen on and didn't rub it in. <laughs> Do you see it? You're like in a shadow. I need you to turn and look at this. Look at it. <laughs> Let me show you the progress. Everybody you know. Oh, you're just pussy. I ain't trying to keep it myself. Oh, mama. Today is a cleaning day. Sean is at work. I just got out of work. So I figured I would come here. Everything, it's like a disaster zone. I will update you because Sean and his friend made some changes after I left yesterday that I haven't updated you guys on. So I actually think I'm gonna shut the garage while I do this just because it's pouring rain. Basically the garage is a mess. 
need to figure out, there we go. The garage is a mess and we need to empty our storage unit tomorrow. So there needs to be space to put everything. And over here is like all the appliances, doors that we took off, but this stuff can be organized. So I'm gonna do that, but let's head inside and see what we're working with. First, I wanna check on the cement that I patched. And it's pretty good. I mean, it needs a little bit of sanding, so maybe I'll sand that, but the big holes are good. There's probably more that I couldn't see while they were here, so I'll probably patch those today. Um, let's check these ones. Okay, this looks good. Definitely need to be like sanded down, but that's easy. There's also just like tools everywhere and like I can't even walk around without tripping on stuff. So I'm gonna clean that up. But this is what I wanted to show you guys. So they did the drywall um, up there. We still have to mud it. We might get someone to finish that for us just because we want it to be done right and we could do it. It would just take us forever to get like the drywall mud like nice and smooth so it blends in. But they did that and then he surprised me with a FaceTime showing me that they ripped out. So the doorways all had these like weird patterns and they completely ripped that out and reframed this one, which I don't really know how they did that, but it makes this doorway so much bigger to the living room and it's actually really nice. So I don't know if they're gonna do the other ones or not, but yeah, the kitchen's a disaster. My big task is to sweep everything from the living room and the bedroom because I think he's gonna work on the floors a lot tomorrow. So I will clean all of this up as well. I love the way the floors turned out and yeah. So I kinda just like need to clean. That's, that's the plan. So I will show you guys the results when I'm all done. Um, this stuff still needs the flooring, but yes. So that's where we're at. So I will stop babbling. I'm gonna throw on my headphones and a podcast and get to cleaning. Okay, I've been cleaning for hours and it honestly doesn't look that different, but I'll show you guys. I also patched up some more holes, but here it is. I organized some tools over here, swept the floors. I This was like all full of tools under here and I cleaned that off and organized them in like different spots around the kitchen. Filled this trash can, swept up all of this mess. Guys, I tried to sweep this for over an hour and the dust just keeps settling, so I'm over it. Um, but I organized the stuff at least. I'm just like so over the dusting right now. <laughs> um, I cleaned this stuff up and then let's go check the garage. She's organized. So I put everything over here in this corner and organized it so that we have some space. The shelves are ready to be filled, organized that stuff over there as well. Just like got some space. I don't even know if you guys can tell or you care, but that's the end of this today. I'm in this same outfit. I keep washing it and re-wearing it because I don't want to dirty other clothes. But the update right now, Sean's taking down this ceiling fan from the living room. I don't know if I showed you guys, they redid this doorway. It looks so good. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else that I can share. Oh, we emptied our storage unit into the garage so that we didn't have to pay another month for that. So, reorganized everything and emptied it in here. We have one more truckload to get um, from Sean's truck. We'll go to the storage unit and get that, but it feels so good to have a garage. We have so much crap and it's just so nice to have a garage put our stuff in and organize it and just like have it be ours and yeah. So that is the situation. We have to do one more load from the storage unit and then we have to go to Lowe's and then we'll come back and get some work done. I put our other like patio chairs out there. The pool looks so inviting. I just want to get in. Who are you FaceTiming? Your dad. Oh, he's at work. He might not answer, but 
Maybe he didn't answer me when I called, but he'll probably answer your call. Success. Ooh, I kind of like it without a ceiling fan. TBH. We can, we can not put a ceiling fan in here. It's nice and open. It makes it look huge. Yeah? Yeah. I'll let you see when you come down, but it looks nice. We still don't know what we're going to do with this little seashell case that they left us. Um, I was thinking like a, I'm trying to think of what I could put there. Right? It's almost like a bean. Oh, you're talking about there. Yeah. I thought you meant for the seashell case. Yeah, it opens it up a little. It looks so much bigger in here now. Last bit of storage unit stuff's in here, and we just went to Lowe's. Oh my gosh, they rode their golf cart here. How fun. Um, and then I have to go do some boring $400 worth of registering my car in Florida and getting Florida license plates. Yay. Uh, I literally just swept all this, but that's okay. So the doorways are out. All of the decorative doorways, they're now large and functional. Dude, dude, it opens up so much. It makes this space look so much bigger. And I... It looks like... I don't know, it just looks different. Like, it looks ours now, you know? Yeah. As our touch And then I've been in here priming the walls. So this was this, like, dark blue color. And I'm just putting primer all over. We got like half the ceiling done. My arms hurt, but we got a big old thing of primer. So that's what's happening. Just got to the house. We have a late start this morning just because we were getting a bunch of other work done, but we got some paint samples. So I'll just show you guys the samples. So possible some of the cabinets is this green called Coastal Plain kind of hard to see and then we just got three different whites to put on the wall and see what we want to do so I'm gonna just watch some paint samples and then my job today is to prime all the walls so I will just be headphones in paint roller going to town so let me swatch these three and then maybe swatch the cabinet color all right, so I don't know if you'll be able to see on camera, but we just did the three samples in different areas around the house. So there they are there, there. We just put tarps down on the floors that we did so that when I prime, I don't have to worry about it. There's the three there. And the last bit of lighting is here. It's crazy because originally, this was my favorite one on the paint sample, but it's my least favorite on the wall. Um, looking at it, yeah, let's do the Oxford, I think, the middle one. Okay, another Lowe's trip later. Sean got a bunch of goodies for the pool. We are new pool owners. Well, I grew up with a pool, but not all year round, and my dad did all of that, so we are trying to figure out. We got a vacuum. Oh, we also got a charcoal grill to make some food while we're here so we don't have to keep getting Uber Eats. I want to go swimming so bad. So I believe if you, let's turn this on. And then you just like put the pole to it and move it around. Sean just says to me, this thing kind of sucks and it had really bad reviews online. <laughs> if it had bad reviews online, why did you buy it? A little charcoal grill. Oh, you found a little hook. Cool. Wow. Cute. All right, I am painting. That was almost really bad. I'm painting the brown wall with primer now. Um, I fully finished the bedroom. And Sean's cooking us some Salem's hot dogs on the grill. This charcoal grill smells good. But I am tired, whew. All right, we are heading out. I primed this brown wall and this one. All of the ceiling fans are down. We have to get all new ones, but 
My mom comes tomorrow to help with the painting. So that should be fun, but we are tired. It seems a lot later than it is. It's only 6.41, but it seems really late. So we're gonna go. I have to pick my mom up from the airport early tomorrow. So I wanna get a good night's sleep. And yeah, turn this extremely bright light off. I am ready to lay in bed. That is for sure. The hot dogs were really good. Sean replaced the door handle in the spare bathroom so that it actually locks. What are you looking at? I asked them initially to put a GFCI outlet in here. Yeah, and they didn't. They cheaped out on us. <laughs> Those bastards. Um, do you see what I mean though, like about this? They should have, if they were gonna leave one and they left it for us, that one should have stayed on the wall instead of this one behind the door. They obviously just pulled it out on accident. Because I'd rather have that one up than this one. This yeah. one's... We'll, just, we'll replace that one. It looks like this one wasn't put into a stud, so that's fine. Okay, right. happy... <laughs> Yellow, black, white. There's yeah. a bunch. Hello. I am setting up the internet. We got our Xfinity package. There's a whole bunch of goodies in here, so that's my job right now. My mom and Paul get in in two hours, so I'm gonna get this stuff done so that we have some internet, and then I'll go pick them up from the airport. But other than that, probably just more priming and painting today, at least from me. Sean's got some work to do. He's trying to figure out the electrical stuff. That's what was just happening. He was FaceTiming my dad because the fridge, the fridge that we have in the garage currently every night when we come back in the morning, it's off. Like it's tripped the breaker. So he's trying to figure out why he replaced a bunch of stuff and it still didn't work. I know nothing about that. So I'm gonna set up the Wi-Fi because this is something I can actually do. And I'm drinking my coffee, relaxing, all of that jazz. Look what has arrived. Our first lawn care set. We got a lawn mower. What's this? Hedge trimmer? Yeah. And what's that? A weed whacker? Okay. What's that? Get to work. Look how long the grass is. The HOA is going to fine us. That is more than six inches, my friend. Is that the. I think that's what it said, but. <laughs> Crazy. Look who's here. We painted the closet. I'm looking like who's here? This is mom and I's job was the closet. It's all we could be trusted with. Yes. It looks like it is finally done. We did it. Well, besides these. Do you want to paint these quicker or say screw it? And wait. I think I can clean it. Okay. Well, we can see that tomorrow, but we're done. We're heading home. Mom and I have a lot of work to do. I have a lot of work to do. She doesn't, but. The closet is done. And we're working on it in here. They just got out of work, it's already dark. But I wanna show you guys the progress. Sean started mudding the new drywall in the kitchen and the doorways. So he started mudding the doorways, he's doing it in here too. My mom was on a cleaning spree and cleaned like everything. So like the doorways were really dirty and we thought we had to repaint them, but she cleaned everything so it looks so much better. Um, and then Paul's been a painting machine. So mom cleaned this whole room, which is staying with this floor, but it was really dirty before. Why? Um, Sean's switching the lights, but all of this is painted. And cleaned the entryway. You can't really tell. I mean, it's dark and. I want to take this rusty thing off. I want to paint this because that. that looks oh, yeah, bad. You definitely have to paint that. It'll make yep. it look so nice if that's painted. And I didn't get the ladder. Did we operate? That's that? okay. Now what are we doing? We're gonna leave them. Oh, I look rough. Oh, stop it! I vlog like this every day. day. It has been a rough day. Did you get to enjoy the pool? Was it nice? I, I fell asleep. It's been Good. Sleep yeah, it feels nice. I, I didn't get in. Well. I, just, I didn't sleep all well. Take away the barrier and see. It's all right. There's an extra spare light around I think they're both plugged in and used. I don't need this. I can use like my flashlight or something. Oh, that's okay. Come on. 
Yeah, I can come in the morning because I have the morning off, but cool. We gotta go to the what DMV place? Yeah. But anyway, so tell them we're going home to make dinner. Going home to make dinner. How you scared of making plans when your friends are calling me a man? How you pull up in the pants and you say you don't even want to dance? makes the dream work hello I have no clue what day it is at this point I'll put it on the screen if I can figure it out but I wanted to show you guys the update currently at the house so guest bedroom is fully done all we have to do is replace the ceiling fan with the old one but walls are done it's painted it's ready to go we need to get new blinds but it's fully ready which is awesome and then coming in here, again, we didn't really do much. This has been like our resting space for our stuff. Oh, he got new smoke detectors. I was and then this floor is all done to here. Needs to be finished, but this is all good. And then going into the bedroom as well. Everything's painted. I have to paint that piece of trim and put it back up. This, you guys know we're redoing at a different time, but the closet is done. Flooring, painted, cleaned, good stuff. Wi-Fi set up. And then this room is all done as well. Again, just the ceiling fan needs to go up. We took out these because they were broken. Let's go see what they're doing out here. Oh, we're starting to clean. Say hello to the vlog. Hi, vlog. We got a lot to clean up and Sean's gonna keep doing floors. Hello, vlog. We're back at the house. So it's day 18 of the home renovation process. And I just went to Home Depot, so I'm gonna do a little haul of what I got. My job today is to paint the closet doors. I'll show you the before. Um, they're not great, so we're gonna try and revive them as much as we can. So for the room that I'm sitting in, I got this like navy blue. And then for the other room, we got this like forest green color. Um, I got Sean this mallet, I need to go give him. <laughs> Grabbed a ton of paint samples for the kitchen cover because we got a couple, we like painted them on and we don't like any of them. Um, and then I got new knobs for the closet doors as well. So. I'll show you guys all of that as I'm filming, but I'll give you a little before and after of the doors. So this is what they look like prior. Um, this one I'm actually gonna do white because it's a different closet. It's like one of the bathrooms. I hope I can get, okay, yeah, this comes off because I've got the new knob for this. So I don't know if you guys can see, they're just like kind of nasty, but we're gonna try and bring some life back. I am out by the road <laughs> with the trash pile that still needs picked up. And I just have it resting on this that we're getting rid of anyways. So let's get to spray painting, shall we? Oh, I want it okay, so I'm not sure how I feel about this. It needs a second coat and I, or yeah, a second coat and I ran out of spray paint. This one's not even close to done. Those ones I thought were done, and now that I'm looking at them, they also need another coat of white. So I'm just gonna have to go get a bunch of spray paint. But unfortunately, it says that the store is out of these colors. So I don't know what to do. Sean, what do you think? Do I get a different color over top, but then they're not gonna match because this one doesn't have a full first coat? Okay, well, stay tuned. Also, an update on the flooring. Sean's killing it. He's got this whole area done. Most of the kitchen done. Ignore the cupboard colors. We decided we don't like any of those, which is just fantastic. Um, this is all done up to here. So he just has to finish this hallway, closet, laundry room, bedroom, and then all the way back in here. But hopefully that'll be tomorrow. Hey vlog, day 19. Um, I showed them the floors last night, right? Here. I'll show you guys the updates. So we're all the way here with the floor. We brought the TV so we can watch the Bills game while we work. We've got trim, ladies and gentlemen. 
We need so many of these things though. We just measured the whole house. We've also determined that I'm absolutely useless in every sense of the word. <laughs> and I've lost count. Just sitting on the floor eating our Culver's, setting up the TV for the Bills game. Mm -hmm. It also got us this really cute welcome mat from Home Depot for the front door. Did I grab one that was freaking broken? I swear to God, it is. Uh, my job, we got all the trim, so I have to sit and paint 30 pieces of trim for the whole house. So that's what I'm gonna do. I need to go out and get the painting stuff, but. This is what we're looking like. It's cold outside today. Can I spread this out of the Okay, so I'm gonna use, we got little rollers. I just have to find where I put those. Okay, let's give another update, shall we? So Sean made some serious progress on the floor. It's all done under that. We're just tarping because they're gonna be mudding the drywall tomorrow. So it's all done nicely in there. And then he carried it out into the hallway. Jeez, just tripped. And I painted 351 feet of trim. So I painted all 30 pieces. It's all scattered throughout this room and in our bedroom, but it's dry, so that's exciting. That'll go up soon. We got a ceiling fan for our bedroom too. I'll show you guys when it's up, but that's the progress. And then I'm excited. They're gonna start mudding all of the drywall in here tomorrow. And then once they're fully done with that, which I think will be Tuesday, correct? We can paint this, which is gonna suck. <laughs> because we didn't have to paint the other stuff because my mom and Paul did. So this is like the one thing we have to paint, but. And Sean, like Sean can start doing trim. And then eventually we're gonna do the cupboards as well, but we'll be moved in by then. Um, but that's just painting as well. We don't like any of those colors. We're thinking one of these taupes. All of it's gonna get sanded. Well, yes, but we're thinking one of these browns or taupes. So I'm like, should we even like, we should keep the plastic stuff and like barely put, like stock this. Cause if we're gonna take all the doors off and sand it down and we're gonna have to like- We'll see. Stock all of it. Dude, what are, what are you gonna do? You just well, we sand it in the garage. What? You just leave them doorless. You leave them doorless and then you have to sand the frames of it. Well, we sand the frames maybe before we put stuff in them then. That's what I'm saying. Like- We'll you, see. You only put a couple plates in here and then- Yeah. All right, vlog, this is gonna be the last update on the house for me because I'm going home for Thanksgiving and Sean's gonna finish her up while I'm gone. But look at how good the floors look. He is almost fully done with the floors. He just has to do this hallway and this spare room. And that's it. The floors are done everywhere else. It looks so good. And then he'll put the trim up. Um, drill the hole for the TV. But those are pretty much the only updates so far. Um, and then the drywall is mudded. I think they just have to finish it tomorrow. This is the only thing that Sean didn't do himself. So we had people come help us with that, but very happy with how this looks. So I think I'm gonna end this little home renovation vlog here. It might be two parts. I haven't figured out how long it's gonna be yet, but I can't wait to show you guys more. We're gonna continue to update all through the next, probably year, honestly. So obviously you'll see everything in vlogs, but stay tuned for Vlogmas because I'll be showing it every day because we're gonna be moving in here next week. So thanks for watching. Subscribe if you're not already, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.